What for? Why? Maybe I thought it was necessary. You know good and well it wasn't necessary. Do you know it? Maybe I sent them out so I can talk to you alone. What? You hurt me. Then why didn't you just say so straight out? Lizzie, I want to talk to you alone, man to man. Man to man, Lizzie? <laughs> Excuse me. I'm a mistake. You're not a man. Lizzie, can I ask you a little question? No. Well, I'll ask it anyways. Why are you fussing with the buttons on your dress? Fussing at the... I, I'm not. Just let him alone. Well, it's nice to never get. It's a, it's a nice dress. Bring you in it. None of your business. A woman gets all decked out. She must be expecting her bow. Well, I... I'm not expecting is anybody. He? I'm not expecting anybody. A woman gets all decked out. She must be expecting her bow. Where is he? Mr. Starbuck, you got more calls. Wait a minute. Let go of me. The question I really want to ask you, how are you going to do with your buttons? It's this. From the moment I walked into your house, before I even said a word, you didn't like me. Why? I said let go. Why didn't you like me? Why'd you go up on your hind legs like a frightened mare? I wasn't frightened. Yes, you were. Of you? Of what? I don't know. Mares get frightened by lots of things. Fire, lightning, even the smell of blood. I wasn't frightened, Mr. Starbuck. You paraded yourself in here and took over the place. I don't like to be taken by a con man. Wait a minute. I'm sick and tired of this. I'm tired of you queering my work, calling me out of my name. I called you what you are, a con man, a fake, and a liar. How do you know I'm a liar? How do you know I'm a fake? Maybe when I was born, God whispered a special word in my ear. Maybe he said, Bill Starbuck, you ain't gonna have much in this world. You ain't gonna have no fancy spurs, no golden saddles. You ain't gonna have no wife, no kids. No little greenhouse to come home to. But Bill Starbuck, wherever you go, you'll bring rain. Maybe that's my one and only blessing. There's no such blessing in the world. I've seen even better blessings, Lizzie. I have a brother who's a doctor. You don't have to tell him where you ache or where you pain. He just comes in, lays his hand on your heart, and you're breathing sweet air again. I got another brother who can sing. And when he's singing, that song's here with you, and it never leaves. I used to think, why am I blessed like Fred or Arnie? Why am I just a nothing man with nothing special to my name? But then one summer comes the drought, and Fred can't heal it away, and Arnie can't sing it away. But me, I go out into the hollow, I look up, and I say, Ring, damn it! Please bring rain! And the rain came, and I knew. I knew I was one of the family. So that's just a story. You don't have to believe it. I, I don't believe it. You're like Noah. You don't believe in anything. That's not true. Yes, it is. You put on your fancy dress, and the boo don't come. You should get a nothing one. You got no faith. Just as much as anyone else. I forgot the money. <laughs> Alright, pick it up. You don't even know what faith is, and I'm gonna tell you. It's believing you see white when your eyes tell you black. It's believing with your heart. And I believe you're a fake. You know what, Lizzie? I'm sad about you. You don't believe in anything. You don't believe you're a woman. And you know what? You don't. You don't? You're not.
turns around. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, 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 oh